Welcome to Audio Codes Training Academy. This video tutorial shows you how to make an outgoing test call. In our example, we will be testing a call made by the simulated phone on the SBC gateway to a remote telephone connected to one of Audio Codes analog media gateways. In our case, the MP11X. Once you have logged into your device, open the test call rules page by navigating to the troubleshoot menu, troubleshoot tab, test call folder, and click test call rules. Click new to add a new row. Configure the test call rule. In our example, Endpoint URI is the calling phone number of the simulated phone on the SBC gateway. In our example, it is 555-7777. Called URI is the phone number of the remote telephone connected to the MP11X. In our example, it is 9764000. The route by field defines how you are going to route the test call to the endpoint. The Route by drop-down list displays three options. If you select Tell to IP, you need to configure the route in the Routing Table page. If you select IP Group, you need to configure the IP Group in the IP Group page and then select that IP Group in the IP Group field below. If you select Destination Address, you need to configure the Destination Address in this field. In our case, we will select this option. Destination address is the destination IP address of the MP11X. In our example, it is 10 13 66 77. From the SIP interface drop down list, select the SIP interface. This is the SIP interface to which the test call is sent and received from. In our example, we will Select SIP interface underscore zero. Application type. This defines the application type for the endpoint. You can use gateway or SBC. In our example, we will use gateway. Click apply to apply your settings. To test the outgoing call, select the outgoing call rule. Click Action and then Dial. The Gateway's simulator telephone begins to make the call. The remote telephone rings. When you pick up the receiver, you can hear the DTMF. You can also confirm the test call in the message log while the DTMF is being played. Click on the troubleshoot menu and then message log. You can see the call made in the message log. You can also find out more information about the test call by searching for the word test end point. Thank you for watching.